right, YouTubers, I told you I'd be back. It's another Watch City Cigar Blend. Old Dominion. On coffee break number two this morning. This was the first blend I tried when I got that order in last week, and I smoked it right out of the bag. I didn't let it dry at all. And I just rushed. I wanted to hurry up and try something. After smoking this all week, and letting it dry out properly, Tastes have definitely changed a little bit on this. When I first started smoking it, I was getting a lot of tongue bite and chemical taste. Most of that went away. Uh, if you do puff a little bit fast, you do get a little bit of bite, but not much. Virginia Perique. I believe it has bright Virginias and red Virginias. But I think there's more bright Virginias than there are red. Very sweet. Very spicy. The way I like it. Almost like a tangy McClellan-esque flavor. Almost. Very nice. Would I buy more? Absolutely. I am going to buy more. This one is definitely more complex than uh, the church warden that I smoked earlier. I mean, of course, they're different blends, but I mean, for just being a vapor, this is definitely more complex. Something you really want to sit down and uh, think about what you're tasting. Tangy, ripe, stewed dark fruits, spice. It's also the same crumble cake form, the same thickness, I just didn't show it. They're all the same. Very nice. I'll probably have another one today and I'll finish Watch City Cigar Blends tomorrow that I bought. I think I bought six or seven. I think this is the third one I reviewed now. Hope everybody has a good weekend. As I'm sure you've all heard by now, the uh, Ohio Columbus Ohio Pipe Show has been canceled. I haven't heard anything about Boswell's. I'm not sure if <clears throat> they're still even going to be open to have a limited amount of people in their store. I'm not sure. But uh, it is what it is. What are you going to do about it? Sucks. Talk to you boys and girls later.